what's up guys and welcome back I am going to introduce to you in a few moments a crazy talented actor that I know and I'm trying really hard not to crack up because he is just a wonderful ball of energy and you guys are gonna love meeting him for the first time on this web show his name is Brett Gray and he will be out in just a few moments to talk about acting for especially you guys out there that are actors or aspiring actors and want to know more about the craft so I'll see you guys soon after this video Shining like a shooting star, you just right. wanna steal your glow, glow, glow. Okay, look what time it is. A diamond pass a quarter snow, snow. Shining like a shooting star, you just wanna steal your glow, glow. Okay, look what time it is. A diamond pass a quarter snow. I'm riding through your city and I'm chilling with no place to go. The lady on my GPS say, oh me, you should take it slow, take it slow. Take Take it slow. Come on, riding through your city and I'm chilling with no place to go. The lady on my GPS say, homie, you should take it slow. Take it slow, take it slow. Homie, you should take it slow. The lady on my GPS say, homie, you should take it slow. Riding through your city, my fitted don't match cause I'm a Philly bread boy. And all these giants on my back, but I be David in the street. You Goliath on his back, I got a whole gas tank. My pedal way beyond a max. Do an endo on his beat when I'm grinding on his track. Think I'm flowing. Down south, but I be rapping back, back, yeah. Shut it down and clear the space. Anytime I'm in the space, 215 my area code, but 95 my interstate. Filling up my dinner plate, you know I got another one. Cause if I eat, my nephew eat. Youngest to the oldest one. A speed racer, rally cars, GPS and auto stars. I'm riding through your city, chilling. That's what I'm going to do tomorrow. Spin about a lot of change, but that's a different number though. I'm shining like a shooting star. Niggas want to steal your glow. Want me at a nine to five. Stressing at a cubicle, my beard already turning gray And that ain't even from a show Okay, look what time it is, a diamond pass a the snow Hell yeah, that's all I talk about All I ever do is blow Speed racer, rally cars, GPS and auto starts I'm riding through your city, chilling That's what I'm gonna do tomorrow Riding through your city, chilling And I got no place to go The lady on my GPS say make this right and take it slow Take it slow, take it slow Homie, you should take it slow The lady on my GPS say make this right and take it slow Slow. Riding through your city, chillin' and I got no place to go. The lady on my GPS say make this right and take it slow. Oh. Take it slow, take it slow. Oh. Homie, you should take it slow. Oh. The lady on my GPS say make uh -uh. this right and take it slow. Man, I jumped in that Benz, burning up that city. Man, them niggas uptown call your boy Big Diddy. Cause that paint so pretty. My switch is on cruise, GPS to take it slow. All the bitches like, woo! See, I'm back with a vengeance. They thought that I was kooky when I spazzed on Facebook and said, fuck, Miss Tootsie. Sound control, eat a dick. I ain't crying over shit. Keep that boot just like a brick. Move them CDs, then I flip. Baby girl said, hit it fast. They said, ball man, take it slow. Reach around, play with my clip. And then let that thing blow. Take it to the Coco Mode. We puffing on that line. Even way out in Japan. Pain, they call me fly, young guy, cuz Riding through your city, chillin' and I got no place to go The lady on my GPS say make this right and take it slow Take it slow, take it slow, homie, you should take it slow The lady on my GPS say make this right and take it slow Riding through your city, chillin' and I got no place to go The lady on my GPS say make this right and take it slow Take it slow, take it slow, homie, you should take it slow The lady on my GPS say make this right and take it slow Take it slow, take it slow Hey everyone and welcome back to my show on ExploreNation.com and with me today is another special guest. His name is Brett Gray. He is a local up and coming young actor and he is super talented. And I met Brett, oh, <laughs> so he's trying to shucks. act modest, but he's, I mean, <laughs> as far as actors go in the Philly area and young kids, I think he's one of the best and he's someone to look out for. So Brett... <laughs> you're touched <laughs> and he's humble <laughs> so Brett to everyone that's watching tell us a little bit about yourself how you got into acting and all of that good stuff well I started acting when I was about 
four years old, I told my mom that I wanted to be in the TV. So she said, well, maybe you should try acting. And then I did a kindergarten play, and it was just all set for me. When I was seven, I started going to Freedom Theater, which is like a really good place to start out if you yeah. want to train and everything. And they got me my first job at the Academy of Music, and I just got on stage, and I just loved it. So ever since then, I've been on my grind, you know, working hard, <laughs> you know, trying to, trying to do what I got to wow. do. Wow, yeah. okay, okay. And th I mean, that's wonderful, and I think it's something that a lot of actors that may be watching the show should take heed because it's good to have training it's good to start in the theater mm -hmm. and you know it's great to have that support system so you can go out and just you know if you want to become an actor you just got to start slow and build your way up and have fun with it so tell us a little bit about what you're working on now is are there any projects are you doing any films or plays? um right now i am training at the actor center and it's a great place for on-camera training and voiceover training as well as theater training and uh, me and Candace actually are working on a movie together an independent film called The North Bend mm -hmm. which I'm excited for because it's my first independent film and it's feature length so yes yeah. no. yeah, <laughs> <laughs> and you go to Kappa is that Kappa right? yeah yes. performing arts high school yes yeah, it is the best that the best. Is. I agree yeah. I agree I remember seeing you in Les Mis recently which was I mean, if you guys have never seen a Kappa play, you, you're you missing out. Because I think I've seen so many different plays, including Broadway, and I have to say that this play, what these kids did in the span of, you guys prepared for three weeks, you said? Mm -hmm. it, three, three weeks. weeks. And three just weeks. to see the final product, it was it was mind-blowing. Like, it, I couldn't believe it. I was like, are, are these kids? They're doing like, mint. like, it was intense. And Brett was in it, and he was fabulous and fantastic. So I just hope that people can see more of you <laughs> because... I mean, you're a great young actor to look Thank out you. for. Thank so you. we're going to come right back and ask Brett some more questions. I'm going to ask him about a little bit more about acting and where you see yourself in a few years and get a bit more in depth. So we're going to play another tune and then we'll be right back with Brett for more questions and answers. Drug one single is hell and 
everything you need in any way you need it, girl. Hey, come fly, come fly. Hey, come ride, come ride. You fly, I'm fly. Don't worry about a hater, cause we sit so high, so high. I'm tired of being down on the ground with a hater. I wanna get higher. I wanna live life to the more like I'm here for the first time. Hey, and welcome back to Exposure Nation. With me, I have young local actor, Mr. Brett Gray. And we were actually talking about impressions. <laughs> see, he's laughing now, I but I had to put you on the spot. So okay. I really want to see you do a little Wayne impression. I'm sure right. everyone out there wants to see this too. So I'm going to let you get ready. <laughs> yeah, I mean, music is everything, you know. And um, I try to put my whole life in everything I do, and you know, that's why I did the Mountain Dew commercial. Cause if you take something from me, do you? All right, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, that's just a little snippet of Brett's talent. I can see him do impressions. Now you know he can do impressions. I also want to ask you, um, so what is your favorite, do you have a specific genre that you like in terms of comedy, drama, like what type, if you had to choose what type of movie you want to do for your next movie or play project, what would you I could really like? see myself in, in a comedy. I think that would be a lot of Me fun. Me too, yeah. But I always wanted to do a really physical, you know, movie with lots of action and fast-paced motion. You know, if they made a sequel to Avatar and they needed a little African American boy, <laughs> okay, you heard that. I hope there's some casting directors right. looking at this because I believe Brett can do it. I, you know, he's extremely talented, he's humble. Little, little yes, and he has some, some guns. You know. We're We're <laughs> so, also, um, are there any classes that you're taking now? Any? you know, schools that you're going to for the summer? Because I know some actors during the summer, you know, some continue to take their classes, some take a break. But yeah. I personally believe, me being an actor myself, that it's good to keep your tools sharp yeah. and to mm -hmm. keep, you know, taking classes. So are you taking any now? And are there also any classes that you can suggest to any aspiring actors and actresses that are watching? Well, I think of it this way. There's always going to be someone out there that's better than you. Mm -hmm. And the only thing you can do is stay on their tail you know what I mean stay trying to trying to push yourself so always always it, you're never too good to stop taking classes or you're never too mm. bad to start taking classes you know there's no there's no right or wrong just do it if you're gonna do it then just do it um, I'm taking the actor center now which is downtown in Philly on 3rd Street it is amazing they have a brand new facility which is it's beautiful on the inside. They have on camera training and they have improv classes and mm -hmm. acting classes, uh, voiceover classes, commercial classes. They have everything. And they also send you out on auditions as you progress in your on camera training and your voiceover and your teleprompter training and everything like that. Okay, so, that yeah. sounds wonderful. So you heard that Actor Center, which is on 3rd Street, mm -hmm. so, which is actually in downtown Philadelphia. It's not too far from Market East Station if you're familiar with that area and also the Second Street Subway, you can go there to the Actors Center. I believe it's Rodney Robb. Mm -hmm. he, he's one of the owners, Rodney and Edie Robb. So if you want to get some acting classes, that's definitely a suggestion that you know would be great for you if you want to take improv, commercial, voiceover, just get your feet wet and you know start your journey as, into being an actor and actress. So I just want to say thank you, Brett, so much for coming on the show. Really quickly, do you have any advice to just give to um, any young actors, actresses watching as well, anything that, if there was one thing you could tell them, what would it be? Um, if there was one thing I could tell them, um, <clears throat> don't be nervous. Just do it. If you're going to do it, then do it. Just just, just try it. I, you'll love it. All right. All right. That sounds wonderful. So just do it. Just like Mike. <laughs> just, just do it. Just do it. So thank you so much, Brett, you're for welcome. coming on the show, and good luck to you. And guys, here's another song for you to, to enjoy. Thank you.